create one GL and we want to assign that GL. Assign that GL. Assignment means mapping that GL. If you map that GL the, during the year end activity, automatically, by automatically, net profit and net loss move to profit and loss account to balance it. <clears throat> note it on one note, everyone. Note it on one note. Note it down, note everyone. <clears throat> note it on note. Retained earning account means retained earning account means like a vehicle. like a vehicle like a vehicle it is help it is help to move net profit or net loss net profit or net loss net profit or net loss profit and loss account to balance it profit and loss account to balance it Basically, it is year end activity. Basically, it is year end activity. But in the SAP, but in the SAP, we need to set up retained earning account at implementation project stage. At implementation project stage. Sir, we need to set up? <clears throat> at implementation project stage. First one, first one, note it down. First one and second one. First, create the G, create retained earning account. Create retained earning account. T code FS double zero. T code FS double zero. Sir, uh, OB 53, sir, FS double zero. Note it down, my dear friend. Please. Please note it down. Whatever I am telling, please note it down. Create retained earning account. Create retained earning account. T code FS double zero. FX or FS? Uh, sure. yes, yes. F, F for movie, yes for uh, small, smile. FS double zero. FS double zero. It is comes under. It is comes under. Reserves and surplus. Reserves and surplus. It is comes under reserves and surplus. Surplus whatever.
रिजर्व्स एंड सर्कुलर्स रिजर्व्स एंड सर्कुलर्स नेक्स्ट पॉइंट नेक्स्ट पॉइंट नेक्स्ट पॉइंट असाइन असाइन रिटेन्ड एर्निंग अकाउंट असाइन रिटेन्ड एर्निंग अकाउंट means mapping we need whatever gl you are creating na that gl you need to map if you map here then the automatically net profit or net loss will going to uh, move profit and loss account to balance sheet in the year end basically it is an year end activity but this configuration step gl creation this mapping these two things we want to do at the time of implementation project only at the time of implementation project only okay can anyone read the note remaining people please check it out anyone retain earning account retain earning account means like a vehicle it helps to move net profit or net loss from profit and loss account to balance sheet basically it is a year end activity but in sap we need to set up retain earning account at implementation project stage first point create the retain earning account t code fs00 it is come under reserves and surplus account group second point assign retain earning account attend it guys these two steps we want to do everyone these two steps we want to do everyone <coughs> everyone please please keep it on your mind everyone concentrate here concentrate here everyone first one first one i want to create the gl i want to create the gl retained earning account gl comes under reserves and surplus everyone everyone what is the number range 11200002119999 we created this accounts group we created this accounts group so here here i reserved one number i reserved one number 110000 i reserved one number for retained earning account maybe later coming classes i will explain you how to create retained earning account how to create retained earning account for the retained earning account purpose i reserved one number 110000 if i tell now you people may be going to confuse maybe later when when we need to explain bole to coming classes coming classes there is a one class called gl master creation that time i will explain you more information okay that is first step i will explain later how to create the retained earning account for that purpose i reserved one number the number is called 110000 the next one next one next one so this number i want to assign or map i want to assign or map these two uh, settings we want to do these two configuration settings we need to do actually okay so next step what is that what is that next step is define retained earning account means assign mapping assignment mapping okay so everyone concentrate here everyone so this is the path everyone spro financial accounting new general ledger accounting new master data gl accounts then preparation then define retained earning account define retained earning account everyone let's go to slash and everyone concentrate here everyone go to spro enter sap reference img select here financial accounting new general ledger accounting new master data gl accounts and preparation this one everyone yesterday we discussed the edit chart of account list and assign company code to chart of accounts and define accounts group now we are discussing define retained earning account means assignment 
So whatever number you reserve na, later you are going to create that number GL number you need to assign here. How to create? I will explain later. So what is the T code for this? What is the T code? How can I see? This is the path actually. Financial accounting new, general ledger accounting new, master data, GL account, preparation, define retained earning account. This is the path. How I can see the T code? Go to additional information, additional information, display keys and IMG activities. So last four digit is the T code. What is that? OB53. T code is called OB53. Everyone, now you can understand here. You can understand how we can assign retained earning account GL. Why we want to assign? If you assign retained earning account GL, what happened? What happened means if you assign this GL, if you create and assign this GL in the end of the year, I will show you. I will show you even FSV financial statements that topic will come how to generate profit and loss account and balance sheet that topic will come that time I will show you like how to how the value is going going to move profit and loss account to balance it. So if you assign this GL if you assign this GL here the end of the year net profit or net loss will going to move profit and loss account to balance sheet. Okay, now consider here. Come to this path, guys. In case, in case, if you want to understand more information, what is mean by retained earning account? Why retained earning account? What is the purpose of retained earning account? In case, if you want to understand more information, just go through this document. So this is the document can explain more information. Okay, this is can be explained more information. Uh, let it be. <coughs> Okay, this is can be explained more information everywhere. Just go through this. What is mean by retained earning account? Why retained earning account? What is the purpose of retained earning account? Everything will. So then you want to ask one question. Sir, okay, I understood. Then how to assign? Very simple, everyone. You just double click on this execute button. Double click on this execute button. And uh, enter here your chart of accounts. Everyone, can you please tell me what is our chart of accounts? PMOC. PMOC. So in case, sir, I am unable to remember this PMOC, what can I do? So click on your browse. Click on your browse. You can select your chart of accounts. What is use page down button in the keyboard? Page down. Where is that? Yeah, yeah. PM operational chart of accounts. Then press enter, press enter. Now everyone, concentrate here everyone. So here, what is this? This is me, our chart of accounts, PM operational chart of accounts. What is the transaction here updated? Balance carry forward. What is this? It is called, why we are doing this? It is the transaction key. What purpose this? Balance carry forward profit and loss account to balance it. Then profit and loss account account type here as a standard X. You want to put the X. It is the standard. Based on the background program here you want to put the X for the standard even real time also we follow same thing. Then here you want to and give your account number. So what is the account number we reserved for the retained earning account? Anyone remember? Double one, double zero, double zero. Oh, very good. Double one, double zero, double zero. Press enter, press enter everyone. Press enter, enter. One warning message will come. Account double one, double zero, double zero, not created. Yes, I did not create a GL. I will create later. So if you yellow message will come, you can ignore, press enter again, press enter again, enter. That is not a error. That is warning message. You can, you can ignore it. If you press once again, then click on your save. 
click on your save. I'm repeating once again, everyone. Concentrate here. I'm repeating once again. Come to this path. Come to this path. Either you can go to this decode and uh, financial accounting new, general ledger accounting new, master data, GL account preparation here. Yeah. Define retained earning account. So you just double click on this execute button. Then give it here your chart of accounts. Then click on your OK. So here, here, this is the one X yes, you want to put for the profit and loss account statement account type. It is a standard. Even in the real time also, we maintain same thing. And here your number, whatever number you reserve that number, not that number you want to assign here. Press enter and save. So this is the process. Now time to ask the questions. Anyone, any doubts? Yeah, hi sir. My question is, ki, can we assign more than one GL in the retail earning account and yeah. set the percentages of profit which is to be transferred at the year end? Uh, not the percentage. Answer is yes. In case if you want to create multiple financial statements, financial statements for the uh, internal, I mean, Indian government report, financial statement for the IFRS, financial statement for the US GAAP. If you want to generate multiple financial statement, then you want to assign multiple retained earning account. If I tell now, then you people will go into confuse. Let it be. Let's move on. But Answer if, is yes. Okay. Even if, suppose if we want to, you know, uh, uh, prepare one financial statement, still we can assign more than one GL, correct? Uh, not required. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. <clears throat> yes. Next one. That uh, when we are selecting an account, like chart of accounts, and then we are going to select an account, hmm. right? So the chart of account is for only the single uh, list of accounts for company, one company code. Hmm. 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 So it's a by default. We can we need to select from that, right? Yeah. For example, for more information, you will get during the financial statement topic. Okay. We will discuss financial statement, how to generate profit and loss account and balance it. That time you will so, understand more. So what you people want to understand here, what is mean by retained earning account? What okay. is the purpose of retained earning account? How to do the configuration? You can understand now. Later, I will explain how to generate the reports, how it can be moving. That time you can understand more. Okay. okay. Thank Everything you. won't cover one day. Okay. Maybe you got my point. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Everyone, I want to tell one thing, everyone. I want to tell one thing, everyone. For example, if you do any configuration, if you do, if you post any document entry postings, if you generate any reports, if you generate any reports, maximum four types of messages will come everyone. Maximum four types of messages will come. What is that four types of messages? If you do anything, if you do anything, click on your save or click on your post, one message will come. Example, example everyone, if green message will come in case if the green color message will come so that is called success that is called success your activity is done successfully completed if green message will come in case in case yellow i mean what we call blue 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 color will come Blue message will come. Blue, blue will come. Later I will show you how it will come. Sometimes blue messages will come. Blue color message. And this is called just for the information. Just system is giving some information. Just for the information. Just for information. Information messages. System is giving information messages. 
in case in case yellow message will come yellow color message will come so that is called warning message yellow color message will come that is called warning message warning message you can ignore it you can ignore warning message in case red message will come in case red color message will come so that is called error action that is called error you must resolve this error then you want to go next step so without resolving this error you are unable to go next step so this is called error or issue or whatever in case red red color message will come so you need to read that message properly then you want to resolve that message resolve that error so in the coming classes lot of errors will come okay green in the green color messages will come that is called success in case blue color will color message will come that is just for the information message yellow color message will come that is called warning message you can ignore it press enter and save red color message will come that is the error data will unable to save until resolve this error okay better can you please note it down this error Done, everyone noted. Tell me, Arvind, sir. Tell me, yes, sir. Uh, sir, yeah, my doubt is why of the entire chart of accounts only retained earnings is given as a separate configuration. And retained, not nah, there is a no separate configuration. This is the standard configuration, actually. Means Re like uh... retained, see. End of the day, end of the day, we want to move. We want to move net profit or net loss, profit and loss account to balance it. So SAP okay. want to give one root cause. Finally, SAP want to send this. This is a business requirement. The SAP want to give one root cause. Okay, you can do this activity. Then it can be moved this way to this way. What is the activity? This is the activity. If you do this activity, the net profit and net loss can move to profit and loss account to balance it. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's like any other GL, we can create just to create the GL and uh, keep it as a reserve and surplus or retained earnings, right? Again, one more configuration. Is there any logic or Logic means the this is the information. If, for example, uh, example this net profit and net loss will going to update automatically the profit and loss account to balance it. In okay. case if you want to reflect automatically, then you want to map. No, no sir, it don't want to get automatically. It want I want to do manually. Then don't assign. Just okay, okay. and you can do that. Here. So we can do that way as well. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Done, everyone. Noted. Yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> so, everyone, I will ask one question. I will ask one question. Now, the topic is called. Now the topic is called physical year. Physical year. What is meant by physical year? Why physical year? What is the purpose of physical year? Physical for, year. For accounting purpose. Uh, I will tell you. I will tell you, sir. I will tell you. Thank you, sir. Sir. Everyone, everyone, concentrate here, everyone. In the general 
accounting terminology in the general accounting terminology we are called financial year in the sap terminology we can call physical year for example for example in english language in english language we are called water in tamil language we are called thanni but both are same objective is same water bole to some people called as a water some people called as a pani some people called as a thanni some people called as a manch nilu but objective is same same way here also you people try to understand the sap terminology also sap terminology also in the general accounting terminology general accounting terminology we are called financial year we are called financial year in the sap terminology we want to call physical year so sometime if you joined any company if you joined any company they are called physical year but they don't call financial year they will always speak uh, sap terminology so don't think what is meant by physical year physical year nothing but financial year everyone everyone concentrate here everyone for example for example everyone for example i will tell you one thing everyone what is the indian financial year anyone april to march yes. april to march april to march uh, april to march ma hari krishna march and uh, like uh, what is mean by uh, us financial year jan to december jan to december jan to december what is mean what is the china financial year anyone remember china financial year uh, june to may maybe yes answer is june to may yeah and uh, what is the australian financial year hey, sumit you can you want to respond now uh it's it's june uh july july, july to june huh? yeah july to june what is the nepal financial year uh we use it uh, like our own month uh we use our own calendar so uh, it's different it's like 20 it's like currently it's 20 79 date okay okay somebody joined from kuwait who is it dubai or kuwait uh, aslam huh? Yes, yes, I guess the same. They will follow US Jan to December. You are joined from Dubai or uh, Kuwait? Kuwait. Kuwait. Okay. Okay. They will follow US. Dubai. Sir. Okay. And somebody joined from Dubai actually. Who is he? Anthony, sir. Anthony, Dubai. What is the financial year of Dubai? Uh, Jan to December. Same Jan to December. Okay. Yes. Delhi. All uh, Gulf countries will uh, follow US. Yes. Okay, all uh, this uh, Gulf countries uh, will follow Gulf US. country. Gulf countries follow US, huh? Yes, US, US. sir. Jan to December. Okay. Jan to December. Okay. Oh, everyone, Dilini joined from Sri Lanka. What is the financial year, Sri Lanka, Dilini? April to March, sir. April to Sorry? March. April to March. It's you April to March, huh? Eh? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. very good very good very good thank you everyone so everyone we we connected from entire world australia dubai us in india kuwait so we are one team actually not only learning not only learning after getting job in anywhere you people want to work as a team anybody will face any issue so then you can utilize this whatsapp group after joining any company any problem will come then you can share this information to one to one then you will you can help each others utilize this whatsapp group okay <clears throat> even i am trying to help in case of anything okay that's a different thing everyone concentrate here everyone concentrate here maybe month april to march 
जान टू डिसेम्बर वट एवर एप्रिल टू एक्सापल एवरी वन एक्सापल इन इंडिया इन द जनरल अकाउंटिंग टर्मिनोलॉजी जनरल अकाउंटिंग टर्मिनोलॉजी वी आर कॉल्ड एग्जाम्पल वी आर कॉल्ड ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू टू ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू टू ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री दिस इज एज पर द जनरल अकाउंटिंग टर्मिनोलॉजी देन अगेन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री टू ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर अगेन नेक्स्ट इयर बोले तो ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर टू एंड ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फाइव ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फाइव बट मंथ इज सेम मंथ इज सेम ट्वेल्व मंथ्स दिस इज द मंथ्स सो ट्वेल्व मंथ्स हाउ मेनी मंथ्स ट्वेल्व मंथ्स वट इज दैट दैट इज एप्रिल टू एप्रिल टू एप्रिल टू मार्च द मंथ्स विल नेवर चेंज month will never change april to march in the general accounting terminology we are called 2022 to 2023 2023 to 2024 2024 to 2025 but in the scp terminology we want to call we need to take we want to call 2022 Generally, we will discuss what is our financial year. Bole to example, I am telling twenty twenty two to twenty three. But in SAP, we want to call twenty twenty two only. But here, generally, we will discuss twenty twenty three to twenty twenty four, twenty twenty two to twenty twenty four. The but in the SAP, we want to call. We need to take twenty twenty three, twenty twenty three. Months will never change. Only twelve months, and here twenty twenty four to twenty twenty five. In the SAP, in the SAP, what we call, we are called as a twenty twenty four, twenty twenty four. Based on your configuration, months will never change. For India, April to March. For China, different. For US, different. Australia, different. Kuwait, different. Months will never change. Maybe this month to this month. but when you are speaking when you are speaking different way for example now for example now example for now in india in india generally we are call generally we are call 2023 to 2024 2023 to 2024 april to march but we are called 2023 only Twenty twenty three only. For example, as per the calendar year, as per the calendar year, everyone concentrate here, everyone. As per the calendar year, twenty twenty three means twenty twenty three means Jan to December, Jan to December. As per the calendar year, as per the calendar year, January is the first month, December is the last month. As per the physical year, physical year बोले तो financial year, physical year twenty twenty three means twenty twenty three means April to March, April to March, April is the first month, April is the first month, and uh, April May June July August September October November December, December. December, as per the financial year, December is the ninth month. As per the financial year, as per the calendar year, December is the twelfth month. Now you can discuss as per the financial year, fiscal year. January, January is the tenth month. As per the financial year. February is the eleventh month. When you compare to calendar year, February is the second month. But February is the eleventh month. February twenty twenty four. 
is 11th month of 2023. March, March 2024 is 12th month of 2023. Then April 2024 is the first month of 2024. April is the first. So March is the last month of 2023. Then when, when 2024 will start? Anyone? When the 2024 start? Again? Anyone? April. April. April to March. April to March. April to March. April is the first month. March is the last month. March is the last month. In the general terminology, we are called as a 2023 to 2024. 2024 to 2025. Like that we are called. But in the SAP, we are called 23 and 24 like this. 23 and 24 like this. Okay. When the 2023 will start? When the 2023 will start? 2023 will start on the April. April, not for the January. When the 2023 will going to end? When the 20 March 2024. March 2024 is 31st March 2024 is the last day of the 2023. Again, April 1st is the first day of 2024. Do you got my point, everyone? Maybe financial people will understand. But why I am telling this in-depthly means non-commerce students also want to understand. Do you got my point, everyone? What I am telling? Yes, no, okay? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay? As very simple, everyone. Very simple terminology you can understand. In the gen, I am repeating once again. For my satisfaction, I will repeat once again. What finance people fine, but non finance people, non commerce students try to focus here. The month will never change here 20 April to March, April to March, 12 months. That's it. 12 months. That's it. It's a normal months. Normal months. In the general terminology, we will speak 2023 to 2024. 2024 to 2025. In the general discussion, we will speak like that. In the SAP discussion, we want to call 23 and 24 like that. So as for the calendar year, as for the calendar year, 23 means Jan to December. As for the financial year or physical year, 23 means April to March. So, January, February, March, as per the calendar year, that is the next year action. But as per the financial year, that is this year only. When the next year will start? Next year will start again from the April. January is not a first month. February is not a second month. March is not a third month. That is this year discussions. April is the first month again. Everyone, concentrate here, everyone. Concentrate here. <laughs> generally, generally, in the general discussions, in the general discussions, we have 12 months. We have 12 months. 12 months means any country we follow 12 months maximum. Maybe April to March, Jan to December and uh, June to July and uh, uh, like uh, June to May, whatever, whatever maybe, April to March, whatever. This is called 12 months. In this 12 months, what we will do? In this 12 months, what we will do? In this 12 months, we can use, we can use day-to-day -day business transaction to post day-to-day -day business transaction in these 12 months we can use 
monthly transaction, monthly accounting entry postings, monthly business transaction postings. This 12 months we can use yearly business transaction postings. Did what is the use of this 12 months? Why we want to maintain this month? Boleto, this is we can use monthly postings, day to day postings, and yearly postings. Apart from this, apart from this, even we can maintain four special periods. Even we can maintain four special periods. Maximum six we will maintain, but four special minimum we mean SAP suggestible four. Four special period we can use. This is the normal periods. Normal months. This is the special months. Say special months. So what is the use of normal months? What is the use of normal month? Day-to-day -day accounting entry postings. Monthly accounting entry postings, yearly accounting entry postings. Then you can generate the reports and all whatever do you can do. Then what is the use of special periods or special months? What is the use of that? Everyone, concentrated everyone, everyone. Listen, listen everyone, listen. Very important. Concentrate here, very important. So what is the use of special month means after completion of 12 months, example after completion of uh, 2023, after April to March, after completion of March, after completion of March, one day within four months, after completion of March, one day within four months, Auditor will come and verify all the books of accounts. All the books of accounts. And auditor also will suggest to post some accounting entries. Auditor adjustment accounting entries. So these special periods we want to use for auditor adjustment accounting entry purpose. Auditor adjustment accounting entry purpose. So now what you people want to understand here, what you people want to understand here, what is the difference between normal periods and special periods or normal months or special months? Normal months, we can use example April to March, we can use day-to-day -day business transaction postings monthly business transaction postings, yearly business transaction postings. Once after completion of year, we will maintain some special periods. So these special periods we can use for auditor adjustment accounting entry postings. Then now you people want to ask one question. Now you people want to ask one question. Sir, how to post normal accounting entries? How to post special account, I mean, auditor adjustment accounting entries. Everyone, during the accounting entry postings, I will explain you. During the accounting entry posting, I will explain how to post normal accounting entries, day to day accounting entries, monthly accounting entries, yearly accounting entries. Then, even I will explain how to post. Auditor adjustment accounting entries. First, now you people can understand what is mean by that and how to do the configuration. Then later, during the accounting entry posting, I will explain how to post normal accounting entries, how to post special accounting entries. Auditor adjustment accounting entries. Everyone, concentrate everyone. Financial year. Nothing but physical year. Physical year. Nothing but financial year. In the financial year, we have 12 normal periods. Four special periods. Normal periods we can use to post 
day to day business transactions monthly business transactions and yearly business transaction special periods we can use for auditor adjustment accounting entry postings okay note it down note everyone <clears throat> note it down note Note it down, note everyone. <clears throat> Put the heading of physical year. Put the heading of physical year. Put the heading of physical year. <clears throat> physical year, nothing but. Physical year, nothing but. Financial year. Note it down, everyone. Clearly, you can note it down. Physical year, nothing but financial year. <clears throat> In the physical year, physical year, we can maintain, we can maintain dual Actual normal periods and four special periods. Actual normal periods and four special periods. Next line, note it down. Normal periods we can use. Normal periods we can use. Normal periods we can use. De to post. To post. To post. day to day business transactions and monthly business transactions business transaction means accounting entry okay and monthly business transactions and yearly business transactions Uh, madam, note it down, madam. Wait, wait. Special periods we can use. Next line. Special periods we can use for auditor adjustment accounting entries. Auditor adjustment accounting entries. Yes, can you please note it down this in the Excel? Whatever I am showing, you can please, please note it down this. <coughs> you can note it down this, everyone, with seeing of my Excel.
Done. Noted, everyone. Done. Yes. No. Okay. Please. Yes. Okay, sir. Done. Yes, sir. Okay. Can you please note it down these steps also, everyone? Can you please note it down this? Only heading you can note it down. Uh, maintain physical year variant and assign assign physical year variant. Uh, fifth and sixth you can note it down. These two steps we want to do now. Done. Just note it on heading, everyone. Maintain physical year variant. Assign company code to physical year, like that. This one is not required. Noted, everyone. Can anyone please read the note? Remaining people check it out. Anyone, please read the note. Not interested. Can I continue? Yeah, let it be, as you wish. Everyone, let it be maintain physical year variant. Maintain physical year variant. So what is the path, everyone? This is the path, everyone. So now I want to maintain physical year variant. Physical year. I want to maintain physical year. How many months? Example, 12 normal months and four special months, special periods. Just now try to understand how to do the configuration. Then later, during the accounting entry postings, I will show you how to post the accounting entries in normal periods and special period. Now you people want to try to understand what is meaning of that. How to do the configuration. Everything won't cover one day. Okay. So it is everything is a chain system. Okay. When you want to understand what that is the main thing. <clears throat> so now you need to maintain now you want to maintain, maintain physical year variant. So this is the path, everyone. SPRO, financial accounting new, financial accounting global setting, ledger, and physical year and posting period variant and maintain physical year variant. So let's go to that. And uh, so everyone, very important, everyone. Very important. Concentrate here, everyone. Go to SPRO, enter SAP reference IMG, select your uh, financial accounting new and uh, financial accounting global setting and uh, ledgers, physical year and posting period. Now, this one, everyone, maintain physical year variant and assign company code to physical year variant. Everyone, if you double click on main, in case if you want to understand more information, what is meant by physical year, why, what, you just go through this document. You, this document can explain more information. Okay. And uh, whenever you have time, just go through this. Okay. And uh, everyone. So, okay, sir, I understood. Fine. Everything is good. I now I'm understood. Bolito. So you just double click on this execute button, double click on this execute button.
than everyone sap already created standard physical year variants in case if you want to use the standard you can use it okay sap already maintain standard physical year variant for example for example if you use space down button in the keyboard if you use space down here b3 b3 is the standard what is that april to march and four special period normal period is 12 special period is four then v6 is the standard july to june and uh, 12 normal periods and four special periods and uh, v9 is a standard october to september four special period 12 normal periods and four special periods even though k1 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 is the uh, calendar year and let let's take you can take k4 better k4 calendar year boleto jan to december jan to december four special periods 12 i mean four special period 12 normal period everyone concentrate here everyone concentrate here concentrate here everyone in case in case your financial year is in case your financial year is your financial year calendar year both are same in case sometimes for example us financial year us calendar year both are same that time you want to click on here this button calendar year calendar year why because they, they will follow jan to december for example for indian people will not follow calendar year april to march is a not a calendar year so they don't click on this radio button us people follow calendar year financial year and fiscal year both are same so they will click on this tick mark they will click on this tick mark then everyone year dependent year dependent for example for example if you click on this tick mark if you click on this tick mark this v3 will work only current year next year we want to create one more one more variant again next year one more variant year dependent in case if you are not click on this tick mark so this v3 will work subsequent year every year we don't want to create this variant it is automatically applicable for next year next year next year next year like that next year next year like that everyone in case if you want to use v3 you can use it no sir i don't want to use standard v3 v3 means april to march for special period it is not a calendar year don't click on this so it is year independent why because it is want to work next year next year next year like that i am not creating for only this year i am creating entire life okay so don't click on this radio button also 12 periods and four special period in case if you want to use the standard you can use it no sir i don't want to use the standard i want to create my own how to create that how to create that very simple everyone very simple how to create very simple <clears throat> so select here respective standard one for example if you want to create follow us select here k4 if you follow october to september select this july to june select this and april to march select this so we follow april to march select this everyone how to create our own that is my target select here v3 click on your copy as click on your copy as and set up here any two digit it may be numerical or it may be alphabets i'm setting here p3 and here april to march 
for special periods description for special period underscore pm pm group of company april to march for special period for pm so this is not a april to march is not a calendar year don't click on this radio button so this p3 i am creating not only this year so p3 want to work this year next year next year next year next year automatically so don't click on this one in case if you click on this one this p3 will work only this year next year i want to create one more okay don't click on this radio button so 12 normal periods and four special periods then press enter press enter enter everyone don't forget copy all you must click on here copy all yes p3 now it's a p3 actually save it's a p3 april to march everyone so what is the mean by p3 so this is the p3 means april to march p3 means april to march then what is your company codes indian company code pm10 one more anyone please respond anyone please 220 one more pm20 pm20 so this is my company codes this is my financial year so i want to assign i want to assign my company code to my physical year i want to assign this and this why i want to assign what is the purpose of you want to assign then system want to understand your company code follow on which physical year which physical year bole to p3 april to march it will be follow april to march it will be follow so how to assign that how to assign my company code to physical year how to assign this is the one everyone how to assign this is the one same path actually same path seven back same path next one assign company code to physical year variant example this is the path actually financial accounting new financial accounting global setting new <coughs> ledger physical year and posting period and this is the path assign company code to physical year variant so what is the t code how i can see the t code anyone my dear students please additional additional information, information. Additional, information additional information display keys ifg activities so here you will get the t code last four digit is the t code ob29 to maintain the physical year ob37 to assign the company code to physical year so how to assign how to assign very simple everyone you just double click on this execute button then click on your position enter company code pm10 here everyone this is your company code in case if you want to follow standard if you want to follow standard click on your browse and assign the standard in case in case if you want to follow standard you can assign the standard v3 april to march no sir i don't want to follow standard i can created my own what is that p3 click on your browse so i created my own p3 actually i did p3 april to march for special period for pm so same thing for p2 so this is my company codes and this is my financial year why you are assigning here system want to understand system want to understand this company code want to follow which financial year system want to understand that is the reason we are going to map here mapping assignment both are same link whatever you do you can do 
So this is the two things. Press enter and save. Slash and go back. Everyone, now time to ask the doubts. One by one, you can ask. Sir, here you specified uh, four special. Madam, players. speak louder, Madam Ji. Please, please speak here, louder. Here you specified four special periods, sir. Uh -huh. so, if, uh, system will count every quarterly, or how it will system consider, sir? Basically, Madam, what you people want to understand. Now, what is the use of special period, Madam? You can tell me, Madam. What is the use of special period? What you understood? Tell me, ma'am. Our day-to-day -day transactions uh, last no, for posting of special period. Period. special period. What is the use of special periods? Auditing, so, auditing purpose. Sir. Auditing and adjustment purpose. Ad special periods we can use for the auditor accounting adjustment accounting entry posting. Auditor adjustment accounting entry posting. posting. Normal periods, what we can use? For day to day, day, -to -day, day, -to -day, day, -to -day monthly and yearly activities. Now you can understand what is meant by that, how to configure. During the accounting entry posting, I will show you how to post the accounting entries in the normal periods, how to post the accounting entries in special period, how to post auditor adjustment accounting entries, how to post day to day, monthly, and yearly. I will show you. Got it, my point, everyone? Yeah, next question. So my question is, ki if we you know, post the entry, accounting entry using the special period, whether accounting. it will, if we post the accounting entry in a special posting period, whether it will take 31st March as a default date or do we have an option to select the date? That one I will explain during the accounting entry posting. If I tell now, you can confuse me. Yes. You can ask me whatever I explained regarding to the configuration. If you understood. During the accounting entry posting, we will discuss. We can post some example accounting entries and we will see how it can be reflected. Okay. Sir, okay, sir. Sir. Yes, sir. Sir, can we create a fiscal year variant without the copy of the standard variant? Ah, you if you want you can create yeah why not why we why we use for copy then we create our p3 maybe my mic is problem or uh, can you speak louder huh? why what do is... you use copy button for creating new fiscal yes, year if you want to create answer is yes you can create new okay yeah, answer is yes. If you want to create, there is a one button, create new button. There is a, for example, instead of copy as, there is a create new button. You can create new. Answer is yes. This retained endings, why it was not uh, mapped at a company code level, but it was mapped at a group level? Huh? Sorry, one second. This wait. retained endings, wait, uh, wait. why? why Wait, 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 wait. Thing was not wait, my dear friend. Wait, 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 wait. So here there is a new entry. In case if you click on your new, you can create here also. You set up here any four digit, write the description for to 12 normal periods four special periods like that in case if you want to click on new you can create got it thank yes, you sir. but sir, you can uh, follow my thing my way hmm. ah, somebody asking why uh, retained learning account ask yeah retained endings uh, we have mapped at a group level a chart of accounts basically uh, chart of accounts may assign one or more company codes that is the reason we can maintain the group level Next. Oh, so indirectly it is applicable for uh, company code itself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Oh, answer is yes. Yep. So, sir, my question is: ki, uh, Do we, you know, assign? Is there any requirement to assign the fiscal year each year? If we do not select the and year, if you want, then you can rate. click on dependent. Okay. You can click on dependent every year. You can create the variant and assign. You can change the assignment. Okay. Yeah. So, thanks everyone. Thanks for joining. Uh, you can whoever not take practice material printout, everyone must take the printout. So today and tomorrow is the weekend. You must practice up to today class, even in case of any doubts. So we already uploaded all the recording videos on the Google Drive. Once again, if you watch that videos, in case if you have any doubts and you can practice, during the practice, any error will come post that error in the group. Other people can help. Everyone, please help each other. In case anybody will not help, then I can help. In case yes, of sir. major issue, then we will collect one to one also. Okay? Yeah, sure. Uh, sir? Go on, mute. Go on mute. Let me complete, my dear friend. Let me go on mute, my dear friend. So, uh, please practice. Don't neglect the practice, everyone. Practice, for example, if I telling anything, so you think everything is understandable. For example, how if you listen Ramayan, everything is fine. Be cool. But when you are follow and follow on the Ramayan, it's very critical. Okay. Critical means we need to follow some rules and regulations. Okay. Then our life become good if you follow Ramayan. Then same way here also. If you during the listening the class, everything is fine. But when the problem will come. When you practicing, when you properly practicing all the rules and regulations, then you success in your life. So, my dear friends, please practice. Okay. Yeah. Tell me. Tell me. Somebody asking something. Somebody asking something. Tell me, my dear friend. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, everyone. Thanks for joining. Let's meet Monday. Bye.